Under the guidance of Education and Natural Resource Rangers, the Appalachian Conservation Corps and Groundworks RBA hiked the Stanton River Trail to begin work on the Dragonfly Mercury Project. These two groups work to engage young people in conservation service projects to support sustainable public access, historical interpretation, and ecological health. The Dragonfly Mercury Project is a citizen science effort that provides data on where and how much mercury contamination is affecting national parks through the collection and analysis of dragonfly larvae. This National Park Service project is in collaboration with the United States Geologic Survey and the University of Maine. Dragonfly larvae are used because they spend most of their life as larvae in waters, they're predators, and accumulate mercury as they grow. The captured larvae are then sent off for testing at the USGS to help the park better manage risk while protecting resources and park visitors from the toxic effects of mercury. This project provides an opportunity for the young volunteers to have a hands-on experience with nature and make a positive impact on the park. This is the sixth year Shenandoah National Park has participated in this national effort. This work, funded by the National Park Service with assistance from its many citizen scientists and groups like these, help keep the park waters a safe place to enjoy.